Oh god, that was great. This we is may the or may not be horrible. But... Nah. Okay, the what shenanigans we get in. Hey, that's fine. When it brought up the honka tonk, the honk term, I was like, oh god. Honka tonk! <laughs> oh, there, Damien, I want you to honk my wonk! Oh! No! <laughs> no! no. Giggly! No! no. I deem this unacceptable! <laughs> Uh, but anyway, guys, I really gotta head to bed, so I'll, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. Night. <gasps> Choke me harder, Daddy. <laughs> God damn it! Really? God damn I hate everything. <laughs> All right, and I'm back. All right. Oh, you just missed it! What the fuck happened? <laughs> Riley left, and he goes, um, he laughs as Goofy. He goes, choke me harder, Daddy. And he hung up. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, you missed it. It was too good. Ah, <clears throat> and of course, he leaves a GIF, an animated GIF that says, "We have breaking news. I'm toasted." Toast. <laughs> yeah. Remember, kids, all toast. <clears throat> toast. Yeah. Oh, good God almighty. Uh, so, yeah, this is the uh, the post show, and oh boy. Um... Yeah, Courtney, I'm not going <laughs> to lie, that was freaking priceless. <laughs> what, did you, what did she say? You got to admit, go to my answer of damaging YouTube status was been amazing. Yeah, it was. <laughs> it was. I'm not gonna lie. That was too good. <laughs> oh. All right. So, um, I just got. Re I just received a whisper, and uh, apparently, I'm told to give a shout out to a uh, magical dude for his birthday. Happy birthday, magical dude! Happy birthday! Yay. I hope this stream was fun for you. Yeah. All right, so there, there, there's my Pinkie Pie. There you go. <laughs> I got a good number of uh, I got a good number of clips here. I got four, but damn, <laughs> some fucking savage answers. <laughs> so yeah, uh, boy, uh, there was quite a lot of games that I played this year. There's there's a lot of highlight reels that are definitely going to take up um most of this month. Um, I'll spoil you, I will spoil you guys this, it's gonna be up to a total of 25 volumes. Oh, wow. Yeah, I've oh, already, wow. like, this is the last one to work on. Um, I'm on the fence of how I'm gonna make the last two, like, they're gonna be, like, two potters of, like, moments of the entire year. Last year, I did a voting on the different clips that people liked, and I gave them, uh, their spotlight. But there is so much to choose from, and it's just too overwhelming. Yeah. But I'm also thinking about, like, just, like, pasting uh, the moments that were already edited and posted in and just, like, highlight all the funny moments throughout the stream. Well, throughout the year, I mean. Still debating over that? Go ahead. I was thinking, like, there is a moment you could probably try to do. What's it, that? It's just my suggestion. You don't need to do it. It's something related to my kid because she keeps popping every now and then throughout the whole year. Yeah, no, there's there's a few. Um, there's already one I'm editing in the works, and I've already made it hilarious. Uh, oh, <sighs> that would have been fun to do to do that for her birthday, though. Fucking so okay. So, uh, looking back on the entire year, there's there's definitely a lot of hilarious moments that, um. That definitely needs some attention. Like, it, it's going to be difficult, which is why it's preferably that I'm going to make it two parts. Um, yeah. Uh, let's the see. Solar one is still, the solar one and you getting spooked was, like, still in the top tier. But holy crap, I didn't realize the Child of Dora Beers one is still pretty high with views. Oh, no, no, no. I'm talking about, like, just moments from the streams, period, compared to the clips yeah. on the site. Um, but I do love the moment where he jumps in during Freedom Plan and goes, I'm here to fuck Alicorns and eat ass. 
<laughs> oh my god. And there's god knows how many fucking, like, cold ones are cracked open. Oh yeah, there's, there was a lot of cold one moments. <laughs> oh, um, Diamond, I don't know if you are aware of some of the moments that happen when Golden screened. Occasionally my daughter would be home and there was a lot of moments where everybody dies of a Dora fetus because of her. Oh okay. <laughs> yeah. I get that with um with Lonnie's kids, like when I talk with her and I just hear Amethyst in the back. Um her her daughter Lion? has an OC. Hold on. You um, said Um no, Lonnie, Fluff Dragon. Oh Fluff Dragon, yeah, oh, I know. Yeah. She's a s yeah, she's a mommy. She's got like three kids. No, she has two. Oh, I was gonna say she like I thought two. she had three. I could have, I could have. No, if she, she has had... two. Okay, she has two kids, and just to make sure that I'm in the safe zone, is she like a single mother or does she have like no, a? No, she has a husband. Okay, yeah. I was gonna say like if she was a single parent taking care of three kids and making a successful YouTube channel, that is a huge amount of respect I would have given to her. But I guess strongly, but I still have respect for her regardless. Um, yeah, yeah I, you just hear her kid's voice in the back. I'm like, eh, dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, one of the one of the moments that happened during Golden playing Freedom Planet, I told I told my daughter that Golden said hi, and she said in response, "Hi, Golden." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know that's a that joke I like dead. to make. That every time she speaks, my character goes like, "Good, turn." <laughs> Yeah, the kids are, like, so cute. Like, I made a lot of people die with, like, a post that I made um, for my two nephews and my niece. And I was showing them MLP for the first time. They're, like, four. Uh -huh. And Nightmare Moon comes out, and they see, like, her get banished. But when she returns, my nephew just yells, She not in time out! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that sounds like it. <laughs> Part two, I was singing Giggles with um, the first Pinky song mm -hmm. with them, and they were like having fun. And when it ends, my niece goes, Why did you stop? You didn't sing enough. <laughs> oh, wow. I was like, God dang it, you guys. Let me see if I can. Um, oh yeah, Matt, you're right, Magical Star. Uh, Nicole, you did clip uh, during when uh, Golden was playing Mario's Mystery, and Nicole did Blissey's Rainbow Ride. <laughs> yeah. That was precious. Oh, you I know hope what? Gets in the highlight. Yeah, no, you know what will definitely go in the highlights. What? He started it. Night but did not. Did too. Did not. Did too. Did not. <laughs> God, Bliss and I were arguing at each other like kids because she keeps touching my fucking diamond. I'm like, God damn it, stop it. I'm, I'm going to pussy wave with my front end up there. Now you can't reach me. Oh, I can, motherfucker. I'll get on your head. Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> I knock you I off with my wings. I didn't know where to post this, Golden, but if you want to look. All some right. suggestions. Oh, God. Oh. And there goes my teeth. <laughs> and my liver. And my kidneys. <laughs> That's the three of them. <laughs> okay, and now I need to I need to show you. Um, and you may go eyes. even more. They're triplets. Oh no! If you want to post the uh, artwork, uh, put them in the art gallery. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know where to post this for like a streaming chat, so I'll remove this if anything. So. Okay. Oh, dude, they're really cute. All right, so. Um, there was a sheet of paper. Oh, yeah, here it is. So, I remember a while back, uh, I was listening down a couple of games, uh, suggested to me. <gasps> Excuse me. Um, so Bliss was convincing me to start a donation goal to help me get a new powerhouse computer. And by saying that, I'm saying it very cautiously, because I don't want people to think that I'm e-bagging or anything like that. But I set up a couple of donation goals for games that I can stream for the time being until I can have access to a wider range of games. And looking back on what I've written down, I have Power Rangers on SNES, which, okay, I don't know why people would want that. Donkey Kong 2. Power Rangers are awesome. <laughs> Donkey Kong 2, as in Donkey Kong Country 2. Um, Mario and Luigi Super Saga. Shovel Knight. 
Diminished Cap from Zelda, and Link's Awakening. That's a lot of pretty... My suggestion. That's a lot of pretty big games. Um, looks like Desert Samurai really likes Power Rangers on SNES. Is it really that good of a fucking game? It's... I've heard a lot... I've heard some good things about the game. It's Power Rangers! Well, of course you would fucking say that, jo uh, Joey. <laughs> yes. yes, I would. And I will continue to say it. <laughs> I need to talk bastard. to Rosie as a Power Ranger, Joey. That's no I'm surprise. Actually... No, like, I think somebody did a vector of him as the White Ranger. No, yeah, as, like, his own Power Ranger. Like, his own Power Ranger, not connected to any, um, actual, like, Power Rangers from previous... Uh. Oh. No. oh. In that case, I like say a... no for it. Yeah! <laughs> you could be the Pizza Ranger. Pizza Ranger! Pizza Ranger! <laughs> There's already a Pizza Ninja, so... True! Yeah, it's called perfect. the Ninja Turtle! No, no, um... One There's of the people... Actual... Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. No, I was gonna... I was letting you go ahead, because you had a better way of explaining it. Well, there it's really old reference, and they haven't done it. One of the the people on a YouTube channel called Smosh, one of the people like Shut dressed up. up, and he's like, "I'm the Pizza Ninja." <laughs> <laughs> I haven't watched Smosh in like a long ass time. Something that would be fun to do in the future, hopefully I can make this work, is um, do like a multiplayer gameplay of Castle Crashers, and hopefully if I get a powerhouse computer, because I tried this before. Um, golf with their friends. Oh god, that game's gonna be. Oh god, crazy. golf with their friends is so hilarious to play. It's gonna. It leads to so many levels of chaos. Oh yeah, no, like the recent stages, like they're pretty fun. Uh, the space stage is frustrating as hell, but the war stage, the worms one, is so much fun. Let's see. Like. I, like, you would have to play to believe it. Yeah. <sighs> One of them includes the holy, uh, the holy grenade. Hi. I got a grenade! I got a grenade! I got a grenade! I no, a like, grenade. as soon as it rolls down, it's a giant ass grenade, and as it rolls down, you actually, you can actually hear, Hallelujah! Oh, my God! <laughs> I can just picture it now. One, two, five, three, sir, three! <laughs> oh my God. Since Mario's missing, why don't you do Mario's time? Oh boy, why don't I do Mario's time machine? More of those horrible education games that Mario was trying to cash in on. Mm. Uh, now you should totally do like you should totally do a Sarah Max stream with Jasper like Ted Lang. Yeah. I will keep. <laughs> I will keep that in mind. What the heck, Joey? You that know, was, there's a better oh, in. <laughs> that was that was me trying to pretend to not be me. We 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 understand. Make a higher oh. donation goal. Yeah. Um. I th so far, and I'm saying this cautiously. Um. The goal that I'm aiming for so far is twelve hundred, which that's a pretty high number, but. These powerhouse computers, they're, um, they're expensive. So, um, I th part of that reason is because either you have a pre-built one that has a lot of good, you know, specs, but there's also ones that are custom built that you can have much more control of, but it's very delicate to build it. Oh, yeah, no, that's no denying it. Yeah. Because I know a few people who, um, who had to custom make their own gaming computer uh, system so they could be able to have a good quality of for their when they do video games and whatnot and those can get extremely expensive more so than when you order one from somebody who can have it that has it all set up in the way you, you know in the proper way oh and, aria uh, i just read your recent tweet mm. Mm -hmm. Who was on YouTube reviewing the best gift ever? Uh, I know. What? Yeah. And who was in the adorable <laughs> outfit that people love to see me wear? Uh, but whose persona is looking like the character? 
Yeah, I saw that you freaking commissioned Spear Productions for that. Oh, you no, cheated. It was, art, it was an art trade. Thank you very much. You still what? cheated. What? what? I didn't cheat. Yes, you did. No, you want to see? No, 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 no. I actually have an OC that looks like the thing. Hold on. I am confused. Hold on. Apparently, Arya made a tweet saying that there can only be one red-nosed reindeer, and yeah, recently no, I changed one. I changed my name to Goldie the Red-Nosed Reindeer because it was the outfit that I've had for a couple of years, one of which I used on the best gift ever. It's still adorable. People love it. I love it. I stuck with it. It's still adorable. I never said it wasn't adorable. He's especially cute when he's, like, in the frog, like, the front row position, and you can see, like, all the specs on it, and you can see the antlers just popping out of the head here golden in art gallery all right that got you all right let's you. scrolling down when was this made i made it last year did you use it in a video not yet <laughs> i had to get shut up <laughs> <laughs> I want, listen i want it to but then i didn't have enough money <laughs> honestly i really want it It is Literally adorable. The best gift ever, I did this, and my first sauna is based off of this. I like it though. It's cute. Hold on, <laughs> let me pull up the first sauna. I was like, there can only be one. A... Starry flame saw, and she was gonna change it to red nose. Like, she, I'm gonna stay out of this. I was like, fight me, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Santa's reindeer are female. <laughs> Santa's reindeer are female, and that's actually proven. Males have antlers in the winter. What are you gonna say about that? Since when was that a thing? It's, I don't know. It's fact. If it was fact, then why was there a male character in the special? I don't know. It's a children's thing. I guess. Oh, shut up, Courtney. God damn it. <laughs> See? That's because males lose their antlers in the winter or spring, but females shed them in the summer. Okay. Uh, Arya, I sent you a, a DM of my uh, daughter's OC. That's so adorable. Thank you. Thank you. She's a half cure and half changeling. That's hence the why she has wings. She's a little cutie half thing. Yeah, it's so cute. Thank you. Uh, I, I might have to find a way to turn the. Maybe I can get a trailgrazer to make a vector of these. Yeah. Winter clothes. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Think? I beat you to the deer form, Golden. <laughs> I beat you to the reindeer. You're forgetting something. The whole Santa <laughs> stuff is very fictionalized. So I can break the rules of the whole reindeer only are only female that fly Santa sleigh. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, keep mocking me like a child over there. <laughs> ladies, I just... <laughs> ladies, 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 you're both beautiful. Chill. You know what? I can't argue with that. <laughs> Golden, Golden, what we can both agree on is we're both sassy red nosed individuals. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, uh, I'll see if I can get Trail Grazer to um, make a vector of, of my OC and my daughter's OC in their little winter get ups. It's for cute. It, so it would cute. be adorable. Especially with her, uh, with my dog, with her wearing that cute little scarf and her little boots. She's having a cute little boots on. It probably wouldn't be a hard recolor too, so there's that. Like all he, all he would need to do is just add a layer for clothing and whatnot, so that shouldn't be too much. Of a you know, speaking of reindeer, how many of you saw the movie Klaus? Oh, I haven't seen it yet. Oh, it's it's really yet. good. I, I've heard 
everybody has said it's good, so now I'm like, okay, I'm about to find a time to where I can sit down and watch this, because I've been hearing every hearing it from everybody, and I have not got a chance to watch it yet! Well, speaking of, like, Christmas movies, too, like, it's not reindeer, but anybody seen Homecoming, the um, How to Train Your Dragon special? No, I haven't yet. It's oh, so yet. good. Oh, it's- don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me. I want to see it so badly. I won't, but I thought it was going to be mediocre. It's really well done. Yay. I don't know why it's getting so much backlash. I don't know why. It's so good. Oh, dear. Why? The heck, people? I mean, the only thing I'll say is that if they continue the way that they made Homecoming, Mm -hmm. it could open up a new avenue for How to Train Your Dragon stuff. Not with, like, I don't know if you saw The Hidden World or not, so. Oh, no, I did. Okay, so. I um, cried! Yeah, so... Their arc is over, but I'm just going to be vague because I don't know if anybody else has seen it or not, but a new arc can begin with those characters. And the way that they do it in Homecoming is very interesting. Okay, that's something I'll definitely take a look into. Like, I I can already expect it. It would be a little bit more lower budget in contrast to theatrical releases. Like, I've seen... no. Oh, really? No. Maybe, like, a, a notch? But no, they... It's beautiful. Okay, well, I'll definitely take a look at that. I Is it available on Netflix? No, unfortunately not, but on YouTube, some people have been posting um, Homecoming, and it hasn't been taken down yet. All right. Well, so because lucky, I did... Because I did take a look at the first episode of the How to Train Your Dragon series, and already the animation looked so uncanny it was hard to watch. Yeah, that's what, um, for the Netflix stuff, it's a little more jaggedy, but if you look beyond that, it's good storytelling. Oh, I'm sure it is. Mm -hmm. It's just, I I would have to get used to that. I'm so accustomed to seeing CG movies predominantly take over cinema and become the uh, finding, like the defining form of animation these days, in contrast to other forms, whether it's stop motion or or traditional. Um, And it's something to see with a high expectation when it comes to that. So when I see something like that, or even animation of Miraculous Ladybug, it's going to look really, really weird to me. Like very jolty and jaggedy and very unnatural. But, like, I've seen, obviously, I've seen much worse CG animation. Like, compare that to, like, I don't know, uh, the, the freaking um, what's it called, damn it? It was an old PC game. It was a really bizarre game, too. Fuck, that's gonna bother me for a while. Let me look at Will Ryan. I know. I'm gonna have to find the, the link. Dang, YouTube's starting to knock down on the thing. Oh, you're yeah. talking about COPPA? Oh, no, the copyright? No. no, yeah, the copyright stuff is starting to hit the videos. But I may have an idea of where I can find the, the movie. Sent it to a trail. It may work still. And scroll down. And... In the browser. Yeah, this should work. Baldy! That's what it was called! I mean, compare the animation that looks like lower budget, but are still on, like, public television, and compare that to Baldy, and yeah, there's a dramatic difference. That's what I meant to say. Yeah. Yeah. I have also seen those bizarre, like, 3D figure animations. Not as, um, not, uh, Source Filmmaker. Um, you know, those stuff, that stuff can be okay to watch, depending on how well they work with their movements. Like, the guy who made that, um, the Remembrance video. Um, yeah. but I've seen ones where it's like, literally, there was a kid who was hiding and eating sugar, and then a bunch of utensils flew into his mouth. I'm just like, what the fuck what? am I watching? Yeah, no, just, just know, right? there's just like questionable bullshit that I'm just like, how the fuck is this existent? I know, right? I, I know very well what you're talking about, and I'm like, okay, how the heck did this get past YouTube? It's not so much as getting past YouTube, it's the fact that it existed in the first place. Yeah. 
Though that does remind me of something else now that we're talking about YouTube. Based on the whole, like, panic of, like, Kappa and shit, how many of you seen something about Kappa from that guy who does the Something About series? Mm. I... Wait, say again? I didn't hear it. Okay, something about Kappa. Okay, so this is done by... Hang on, I'll figure out who that is. Terminal Montage. Terminal Montage is known for a lot of, like games that are parodied like something about kirby or something about mario something about whatever they have a the animation is incredibly amateur but the humor and the timing is so beautifully well put together that i can't help but fucking laugh at it so much it goes into like oh, yeah like there was yeah it's it's very dramatically like presented in humor mm-hmm. um like, think of it in the animation style you'd see on, like, Newgrounds. You know, that kind of amateur yeah, animation. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, anyways. I, I, I know him now, yeah. Anyways, he did one about Kappa, and it's hilarious that you see Kirby pop out, and everything's all colorful, and you see the little screenshots of all the guidelines that the FTC says, like saying, oh, there's you're not supposed to have animated characters, cartoons, or bright colors. So everything turns into a grayscale. There's a square and a rectangular shape. They're geometric shapes, and they say, hi, how are you? How's and it shows like different things like did you hear about this game? Oh, we're not supposed to talk about sports. You're not supposed to talk about other things. Like how is oxygen breathable? <laughs> it's funny as shit. And the like the whole presentation is so utterly depressing. Like they have this like background music that goes all Yeah, they have this, like, descending note, and it goes over and over and over, like, yeah, this is very depressing to look at, because it just sucks out everything of what people love about videos based off of those vague guidelines. So it's such a huge jab at the guidelines that the FTC and what YouTube made. <laughs> yeah, right? This oh, video is now COPPA compliant. They use a lot of robot voices. <laughs> that is Priceless. Oh, oh yeah, no, it is. It's very cleverly put together. I have to applaud the people who created that. that Terminal is- montage. Terminal montage is so hilarious. I'm gonna go ahead and link it to you guys here, and I'm gonna go ahead and link it to this chat here. You could take it a look for yourself. Okay. Terminal montage. Either way, I. That's my Go ahead, Joey. Sorry. Either, either way, I kind of have to head off. All right. Okay. Talk to y'all Bye. later. But all right. First, I boop all of y'all. Uh, all right, then. <laughs> later. Goodbye, Joey. Yeah, I'm probably going to start coming off, too, but um, I'm going to send you... I sent... Um, one of you guys a link, but Golden, I'm going to send you a link to the Homecoming. This is a link that somebody gave me. All right. And it's actually a pretty safe website. All right. Wrong area. Okay, I'll, de- <laughs> I'll definitely, definitely take a look at that. Yeah. Um, with everything winding down, right. I think it's time that I call this one the last post show of the year. Periodically, I might um, do some editing streams. Uh, there's going to be some podcast post shows. I'll see what I can do. Like tomorrow, I'm going to try to get back into making another podcast because I really want to talk about Klaus or Klaus. Sorry. Um, and there's like other material to talk about. In fact, tomorrow, at the time of you know the, the, this recording or as of this night, um, the first uh, episode of Steven Universe Future is going to be playing. Ooh, I'm actually pretty interested about that. Steven Universe Future. Yeah, I'm definitely interested in that because in the previous podcast, we talked about the uh, Steven Universe movie and so much praise was talked about uh, Spinel. Mm-hmm. That's right. I heard this story over and over again. Gee, so it's well to finally... Lux incarnated? <laughs> what? Wait, what? What did you say? Lux incarnated. Oh, my God. I'll give you that. Okay. So with that all being said, thank you for the rest who have been watching. I'll see you all next year when I stream Golden Fox Plays again. Happy holidays!
holidays, everybody. See ya. Happy 2020. Let's hope you don't get fined 42 grand. Yeah. <laughs>